So in this video, I'm just going to be going over how to figure out what gen eds you need and how to register for the classes that correspond to those gen ed requirements. So specifically for the College of Engineering, um, to figure out what gen eds you actually need, go to UIUC Engineering Gen Ed Requirements and navigate to the, um, to the wiki page here and it'll pull up all the gen ed requirements that you need. So it looks like for the College of Engineering, um, you need 18 credit hours. Um, of those 18, six has to be humanities and arts, six has to be social and behavioral sciences. One of these courses has to be Western or comparative cultures, and one of them has to be non-Western or US minority. So if you click on each of these links, it'll take you to all of the um, classes that actually satisfy that gen ed. And for example, if you want to do Asian American Studies 100, then that actually falls in non-Western slash US minority cultures and also social and behavioral sciences. So Asian American Studies 100 and classes like that that fall into multiple categories actually counts for both of those requirements. Um, so to actually sign up for these gen eds and figure out um, which ones and to figure out which ones fall into which categories, again, just navigate to um, your registration page, which is, which is covered in the registration tutorial video. So go to that same tab, Enhance Registration, um, and from here, you just want to click on Browse Classes if you don't know which Gen Ed you want to take, but you have to fulfill one of those require requirements. And Fall 2018, um, from here, uh, if you click Advanced Search and on this Attribute part, you can actually see it pops up with all of these um, Gen Ed requirements. So, um, if you need to satisfy your cultural studies, your non-Western, for example, uh, click on that and you can, there's a multitude of different specifications you can make. Um, if you only want to meet on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, for example, just click those three days. Or if you just want to start at like 9 a.m. and then end at 10. You can make all these specifications. Um, I'm not going to do any specifications for now just because I want all of the classes that fulfill cultural studies non-Western to pop up. So if I click search, all of the sections, all the lectures, all the discussions that satisfy that gen ed will pop up. It's a bit much. Um, you see there are 20 pages at 10 results per page, but just to give you an idea of which classes you can actually sign up for. Um, so yeah, if you want to sign up for, let's say, um, let's do, I don't know, introduction to, no, that one's full, okay. Let's do Asian mythology. Well, this is going to be the discussion section, so as covered in a previous video, um, just make sure you do sign up for the corresponding lecture. And it'll show you all the requirements that it satisfies, as well as the credit hour, the title, the course number, the department that it falls under, as well as um, the requirements that it satisfies. So it looks like um, Asian mythology satisfies one of or it um, falls into the humanities, which if you go back here, you need six hours of. So um, Asian mythology, mythology will take care of three of those six hours. And also it satisfy or satisfies your um, non-Western gen ed, which you only need one course in it. Um, so that's how you pretty much see which classes satisfy which gen eds. If you do want to actually register for a class, um, let's go to so, uh, registration, register for classes, fall 2018, and let's do, um, let's just do Asian American Studies 100, for example. So if you 
look for all of these, um, there is a discussion section and a lecture. And specifically for this class, the discussion and lecture do have to match. So the lecture starts with A and the discussion also has to start with A. So if you go in and click this, go to um, attributes, it will tell you which gen eds this satisfies. So Asian American Studies 100 satisfies three of the six hours you need for social and behavioral sciences. It also satisfies your one class needed for um, US minority. And just go through and make sure that you know all the gen ed requirements um, required for your major, because even though this is for generally the College of Engineering, different majors might have different gen ed requirements. Um, so that's about it for gen eds. If you have any more questions, again, go to the chat room and our registration assistants will be more than happy to help you with gen eds. Um, that's about it. Um, happy registering for gen eds, I guess.